Hey everyone, and welcome back. So, I know it's been probably like a whole month now. Um, it's just partly of me being really lazy and just not wanting to make a video, but we're back. So, this is an idea from someone who's already given me a couple ideas. His name is um, Nick. So, today's video, I'm going to be doing a what if. What if, um, Train was a moon of Ganymede? As you know, Ganymede itself is a moon of, um, Jupiter, so I don't think Triton's gonna survive for long. If anything, it's gonna collide with Ganymede, or Jupiter's just gonna take in... I, I don't know how to explain it, but we'll just see what happens. Alright, so I do have a custom Triton, because they don't... They never, um, actually made... See, I can find it at least. Um, I'll try to get past it. Alright. So, Triton is maybe around half the size of Ganymede? Or less? I'm not sure. But all I know is this is probably not gonna end well for Triton. So, okay, let me pause. Okay. So, you have Triton right here. Ganymede right here, and it's ordered around Ganymede. I don't know if I should move it, get, try it a bit further away, or should I just leave it there? I'll just leave it there for now. So, you can see... It's, what if it's actually doing alright for now? I mean, it's only going an hour or a second. Triton's orbit is moving a tiny bit. I may try this with Callisto also, if nothing happens. So yeah, nothing seems to be happening. Let me um, let me move it away a bit further. Now let me try it. So Jupiter should have a. Stronger gravitational pull on Triton. Looks like, well, Ganymede still has a stronger gravitational pull on Triton. So everything seems to be somewhat stable. I'm sure if I play this like really fast, I'm sure Triton will just collide. Right. Let's move it even further away. And see if anything happens. Okay. See? It's orbit is moving a lot more now. But it still seems to be very stable. Huh. Okay. Let's move it even further away. Let's move it over here. So Jupiter doesn't just grab it right away. Alright. Um, it looks like Jupiter has a stronger gravitational pull on Triton. So if anything, I, I think it would just stay in a stable orbit if it was close enough, but I don't know because if Triton was even even closer, I think, um, I forgot what it was called, um, Roosh Limit would destroy Triton. So let's try, um, Callisto. Now I'll try Europa and um, Io. So I'll put that right here. So Callisto should be fine. Because it's the further, furthest, um, excuse me, fur, um, fur, farthest, um, <laughs> pardon me, um, is the farthest uh, moon away from Jupiter. So I think. Train should be fine. If I let's see, if I move it way out here, will it still be able to orbit Callisto? Don't think it would. So still hanging on to it, but if it comes, it may actually collide with Callisto. Yeah, it probably is. Let's slow this down. 
Whoops. I'm gonna take a quick screenshot of this. So yeah, that that would just collide with Callisto. I'm gonna do something real quick just for the thumbnail. Right. Okay, that was just for the thumbnail, sorry. But yeah, that that would just collide. Just speed up time. Let's go to Europa now and see what happens. So, Jupiter, I think? Yeah, no. Train is almost the same size as Europa. So I don't... But it, it is also closer, so I don't expect... Triton to stay that long. It may also just collide. Yep. Just collide. Okay. Let's try Io now, which I think the same thing is probably gonna happen. Yep. So yeah, um anything Triton will just collide because of uh, Jupiter and its gravitational pull. If you were to put around um, Ganymede close enough, it could stay in orbit with Ganymede, but if it's too far away, um, Jupiter will pull on it. Or it will just collide with, with Ganymede. But yeah, um, if you have any video ideas, just comment down below and I'll see if I can do it and I'll see you in the next one. See ya!